Okay, before we start, I just like to add that I'm going to be showing you these. You should definitely check out the brand new sh shrine designs. Uh, they changed it. It looks uh, much more realistic in a way, I guess. But check it out. Anyways, here we go. Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Dragon Veil. A number of new things are happening or have been happening in Dragon Veil, and I'm just going to sum it up really quickly. So they made a new update recently that allows uh, level 15 and over dragons to have better breeding rates. Monday we seen, or Tuesday actually in fact, we seen a brand new dragon called the Thunder Dragon. And today there's a brand new dragon called the River Dragon. So both of these new dragons are really, really simple elements. So they're really just two element dragons and they're not really that difficult to get and they are not limited time so um definitely you have a lot of time to uh breed these dragons without worrying let's dive right into breeding the river dragon the river dragon is a two element dragon consists of uh water and earth the only other dragon with water and earth so far has been the mud dragon and they add this brand new dragon to the lot to get the river dragon, you can simply use the water dragon and the earth dragon. The breeding time is 13 hours, but it's not really that easily uh, gotten unless you're really lucky. You can alternatively use the mud dragon and the water dragon or the mud dragon and the earth dragon. That's about it. Just look for a 13 hours breeding process and that would mean that you have the river dragon. The egg is going to be... Uh, blue with like stones over it like the earth type dragons and it'll take another 8 13 hours for the egg to hatch anyways good luck breeding and i hope to see you in the next video see ya